What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Model WordPress Teams and in today's video we're gonna learn how to import a layer of content from another slider into a new one using Revolution Slider 6 WordPress plugin. So in the latest video that I'm gonna leave a link in the description below and a card over here, we did learn how to add an action into a button, like this one, that we click, we go down on the page and open a link. And let's imagine that you want you have a new slider without content and you want this button into this slider. This button style, this button actions, whoever you do not want to waste time to spend time trying to recreating the button. How to do that? How to import a layer from another slider using Revolution Slider? First of all, go to our WordPress dashboard, Revolution Slider, and open the slider model. We're gonna hover over the slider title, in our case it's the slider named as Learn, and click on it to load the content editor. And it's gonna open our slider. We're gonna create a new slider, hovering the sliders tab, and new slider, click on blank slider, and following a video that I'm gonna leave a link in the description below and a card over here, we're gonna apply a background image into our new slider. Let me select some image from our media library. Some image with a good quality. This one gonna work. And now we're gonna click on add layer in the top section of the slider editor. And look all the way down until we, until we see the import layer button. Click on it and it's gonna open all a list with all our already made sliders. If you have made a slider, you can import from it. I'm gonna import from this slider, but the slider number two into the new one, the slider number three. I'm gonna hover over the slide two, click on it. The name is just an example, okay? You can change it. And you're gonna find all the layers of content into this slider. We're gonna select the ones you want, the one, the three, and import. And now we have a second slider with the layers of the first one. Simple and easy. Let me refresh the page. Yeah, let's just wait a moment until the slider changes for the second one. Of course, you can change it, but we're gonna see that in the future. In the future, and as you can see, the layer it's now on the another slider. Let me just go back to the config and into the arrows, I'm gonna set a zone so we can move by the slider faster. faster. Now we have the arrows so we can navigate into the sliders. Just the final change, the final customization. I think that the slider hedge it's too big, so I'm gonna change it. Into the layout tab, we're gonna find the 900, it's too much. Let's try something like 700, 700. It's better in this way. And you can change and copy layers from another slider, not the one, not the same one. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question, and don't forget to check out the visualmodel.com portfolio of amazing WordPress teams, and I see you later. All the best!